All right, well, let's get started on, uh, well, getting this thing ready for no name. And we'll start by mounting the fuel cooler, the, the new one that we got here. So let's start doing that. <laughs> So I still don't have all the fittings to actually get the thing done. Still waiting on one fitting that is holding up me getting the entire fuel system done. But we can try to get that thing mounted. And where I'm going to mount that is right up here in front of the radiator. Right here. You know, because that would be... God damn, I gotta clean this stupid thing up. Bugs everywhere. Anyways, so... But first, let's get this old unit out of the way and out of here. Just like so. Okay. Well, that's out of the way. Now, uh, now I gotta see what I can do with here, because this is where I want to mount the actual thing. Well, still a gas in it. Good. Yeah, just as I suspected. I'm gonna, because I'm gonna use bulkhead fittings through there. And I'm gonna have to move that, relocate that, because it is right, right in the goddamn way. Okay. Well. You have any sockets? Back of the Equinox. On it. Okay, this will work. I relocated the box. I just kept those two things there. Uh, let's see. Hey, you got any soap? No, he's not listening. He, he don't have self tappers. Oh, I, I got the solution to this. And ba bam Now, here is a little known fact about zip ties that I don't, you know, people don't really do this too much with them. Zip tie rivets. You just take one zip tie, you know, because this, this head, you know, has to be smaller than the hole you're threading it through. Thread one zip tie through, another zip tie on, and now you have basically a zip tie rivet. Look at that. Just cut the ends off and it's, it's out of the way. Well, we got about that far now. Uh, let's, uh, yeah, you just keep, keep practicing there. Uh, let's get this grill out of here. And that way we have room to actually look and, you know, because we got to drill holes through this course port here. Now what is holding this? Oh, yeah. Easy enough. So basically what we want is we need two holes about there-ish and there-ish. And then they'll fit perfectly right there. All right. We did it. Uh, we were not able to make it so it's going to sit absolutely flat. It's going to be cockeyed just because of the restrictions we had within here. Up here, mostly. Uh, all this garbage was in the way. Uh, but it's on. Let, let's put that on there now. Now this is a little crooked, but it's actually ideal because it gets it more into the path of uh, the airflow coming in. <laughs> you shut up! I'm making excuses, okay? <laughs> um, so, anyways, <laughs> there it is. Uh, so. Just, uh, just gotta plumb the rest of our fuel system up now once we get that. I don't care. I don't care. I don't... Okay. Okay. Alright. Um. Yeah, I still need the other fitting to finish the rest of the fuel system, so. That's a bummer. But at least this is on. Um. Unfortunately, I was hoping this would kind of keep it sturdy. It's not... Not quite as sturdy as I was hoping here. Um, might need to come up with some sort of something to hold it up here. I don't know yet. We'll we'll figure that out later. Yeah, that 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 fixed it. Yep. Okay. Well, I mean, we don't 
Don't necessarily want that to be sticking out or anything, so we'll just kind of give her a quick... There. Fixed. Well, I just wired it to this old uh, switch that used to be to the gauges, but no longer are. And as we can see, she works. Pulls quite a bit, actually. It's really nice. Not only is it going to uh, cool the fuel radiator, but all this air is getting blown into the normal radiator too. So it'll help cooling that. Neat. You can't even notice that there's a crooked black box in there. See? So what'd you think? Looks pretty good, huh? Except for the Look at it. Looks good. The car. I mean, other than that, uh... And it almost got lost. Don't, don't look at it. So just, just stop looking at the car. That's just not gonna, you know, no support whatsoever. Any hoozle. Support? That, yes. Oh, well, yeah, you should have tied that in better. Well, look, okay, it, it's not going You didn't anywhere. even wiggle it. And say that ain't going. Anywhere. I did. I did wiggle it. You didn't wiggle it. I mean, so it's I. Not, it's gonna blow I didn't up. wrench on it, but I wiggled it. All right. It's gonna blow up now. Okay. Well, anywho, that's all we can accomplish right now because I don't. You know, we need one fitting to get the rest of the fuel system done. So once I get the fitting, then we'll plumb all the lines and everything else, and it'll be finished and ready to go. That part of it, anyway. Right. You plumber? Uh, no, not by trade. Oh, okay. Yeah. This should go it, swimmingly it then. Right there. It right there. Yes, uh, I believe it will. I believe it will. And also, right speaking of no name, this guy over here is trying to get his 500 subs so he can race a U-Haul. New guys guitar. At least it's not law. So yeah. you should. Uh, all the music you ever hear on my channel. He he made it, so you know. The new guy's not garage. The new guy's not garage. Oh, that's a good channel name. Should have done that. It would have covered more stuff. <laughs> True, it would have covered a lot more stuff. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so, go subscribe to New Guy's Guitar. Get him his 500 subs by No Name, so he can race a U-Haul against a Model T. So that's going to be an epic race if that ever happens. Yes, it don't matter. Model T, Model A, Model B, Model iPhone. I'll beat them all. That's right. U-Haul will win. And uh, that's pretty much it. That's all, that's all we got. That's all we got. Is that all we got? That's all I got. That's all I got, too. All right. Catch you next time. So we're done for today? Yeah, pretty much. I think so. What's that we thing? We're supposed to be in the car. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I guess that does have the fuel filter on it, doesn't it? Does fuel need filtering? I mean, I just drink it straight. But... Oh! Ah, okay. Ah, we'll just put it right down here. Oh, wait. You don't mind there's gasoline all over your grass, right? No, I didn't think so. All right, we're just gonna... Yep. Good as new.